Oh, uh, yeah. Let's see. Today is August 27th. I have to return to work after uh, about a... It was only a one-week hiatus. Fuck. Um, last prediction for UFC. I said Holloway and Anthony Smith. Uh, Self-admittedly, I'm not the biggest fan of uh, Ryan Spann. And that's not like I dislike him. That's I don't really know. I didn't know anything about him. Uh, and it looks like I actually called these two correctly. So good for me. Um, I fucking... And one and two for predictions on fight cards now. So... The next one is September 9th, Labor Day weekend. Which will be... Actually, is it a Labor Day weekend? I kind of don't think it is. I'm going to have to Google it when it is. Oh, and they September 4th. Hell yeah, so I'm going to fucking basically have all weekend to play Starfield. And I'm going to go... Dude, this is an easy one to predict. So I'm going to go Volkov, Adesanya... I don't, I don't even recognize anybody else's name. Holy shit. Uh, yeah, Taito Ivasa, he's basically, now this is going to be a tough one for Volkov because he kind of, he was piecing up Derek Lewis in, in their fight, but Derek Lewis made a comeback. And Taito Ivasa fucked up Derek Lewis, so uh, basically we're looking at MMA math. Taito Ivasa should be Volkov, no problem, but uh, I think Volkov will be able to outstrike him uh, just with technical expertise. Um, wow, he's a, he kind of is small for a heavyweight, I think. What's his weight? Oh, 258, man. I wonder if he finished his back tattoo. That kind of wasn't cool. Uh, back tattoo. There we go. Yeah, I think slowly getting more and more. I remember seeing like a weird fucking moth thing, and I was like, oh. Oh, that's like a fucking Shogun mask. That's sweet. So when it was the weird moth thing, I was like, that's kind of lame. You got like a giant moth on your back? That's. But then it was just a fucking Shogun. Yeah. Let's see. Now on to more important matters. I just saw the most interesting baseball game of my life. The Mariners. Uh, they were playing the... Holy shit. I don't even know. <laughs> I just sat through like two, uh, two and a half hours of baseball. And I don't even know who they played. It was Kansas City Royals. And they just beat them. Is this scored out of a series? Well, that wasn't the game I watched. Yeah, 2-3, final. Yep. Uh, Julio, I can't remember his last name, basically hit a home run with a base loaded, and uh, they got three, and then there was another home run early in the third inning. So that's kind of cool when baseball is interesting. But they changed the rules. I didn't know this, but they changed the rules to speed it up. You got a pitching timer, and I don't really know if that's like a, it's got to be hard on the shoulder, I feel like, if you're a pitcher. Um, but it did definitely feel fast. I, I liked it a lot more than any baseball game that I had been to previously. There was the wave, there was, somebody sitting behind me said they hate the wave, and I'm like, how the fuck do you hate the wave? Like, what? It's all of everyone getting together and raising their hands and having it circulate through the stadium. Like, how the fuck... What do you have against that? What the fuck? I hate the wave. I hate the... I hate you, bitch. I hate you, you fucking wave-hating bitch. Like, I did not even want to go to the baseball game today. But... I like the wave. Um, seats were good. 
And I'd probably go to more baseball games with those rule changes. I don't know about the 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 one where it's the fourth and they automatically get to second or something like that. I don't know about that rule. It seems like a I don't know. It seems like a weird like unfair rule a, a bit. You shouldn't advance in the game because time. Baldur's Gate 3. I wanted to become a dark justiciere and kill Shadowheart. I think that would have been like one of the coolest moments of story that could have been pulled off by you, Larion. Everybody's fucking looking at you. I spent... Good amount of time, I would say. Um, doing like every outcome possible. How far down can I just go? Any other quests? No more. I might as well get tired. Oh, I should have got that one fucking lady. I apparently can get one of the. What is it? One of the Harpers is like, yeah, here we go, this bitch. Oh, here we go. I accidentally dropped this. All right, Isabel, I think you can get her as a follower. What's happening out there? Who was that streaking across the sky? Jade, end this. No. I thought you could actually convince her to come with you. Moon Maiden. Hmm. Moon Maiden. Okay, well, I'm just gonna go. I don't really find you that important. Hull Sin is fucking important, but you're not. Anyway, um. So, Shadowheart. I, I, she's not a character I like. Uh, I actually find her quite annoying. She's just obsessed with the fucking. Holy shit, there's a lot of loot here. She's obsessed with becoming. Dark Justice here. And she has been from the start of the game. Cool. Good on you. Oh shit. Maybe fucking. I'm gonna send this all to fucking Halston. He's obsessed with, um. Not the Night Song, but the. Um, Holy shit, I forgot her name already. I just played this last night. I'm so encumbered that I'm gonna just... Anyway, she, uh, anyway, she fucking... She, she's just bitches, like, a lot. And I, I found it so annoying when I was going through, so she has this destiny, right? If she stabs the night song with um, Spear of the Night, she'll basically become the Dark Justice here. I, I spent, I did this three different ways. There's one way where you basically can kill Shadowheart and then kill the night song, but you kill her over and over and over again. And I was like, what the hell, I equipped the spear. Is it because I'm not the chosen that you won't let me fucking become a dark justice here? Like I went through everything. And no luck, you can't do it. Um, the other way is you can persuade. And carve a path of brightness to the accursed one's second death. You can persuade what's her face. That beacon of angelic wrath has taken the fight to Ketherick on the rooftop. In the first line of defense are dead. Shadowheart to abandon her dreams and she's kinda happier, but she's sadder. Will 
a little bit. The only reason I uh, went with that ending is Shadowheart is my only fucking cleric in my party. And I don't want to reroll Laziel to be a cleric. I just think she would be a weird one. Personality wise. So how shall we proceed? We move in, secure the ground floor, cut off the the high helper. You tell me, do what you will, just don't get in my way. A sound strategy. Once it's done, me and my harper say the word. And we're off. Hell yeah, Jahira. I'm touched. But I'm already spoken for. Very well. Side by side we'll stand. As we'll rip through souls from his body. So the trick with Jahira joining your party is um, she's in your party basically for this whole Catherine Thorn battle. So Shadowheart is a really good cleric. And that might pose a problem for me. So she, She's like an older, angrier Gal Gadot. Um, so one other way you can have on that ending with the night song is to do I have to is she gonna be at my camp speak oh, she fucking... All right, you have scrolls you have pots Yeah, she a little scroll and she a little pot of the shield of devotion. That's pretty fucking good. We really not have cloak. Do you have cloak? Yeah, that's pretty good. I'll take the plus one armor class. I actually had a pretty fucking hard time with um, Balthazar. If you put, push the big guys off the cliffs, it's not that difficult, but um, I thought the cape went that way. What was my cape before this? What the fuck ever. Was there one? I don't think there was one. Oh. So yeah, the other I, I keep losing track of what I was saying, but um Just whoever picks it up gets the Iliathead. Alright, let me see. Somebody has all that wasted gear. Fucking, I'm still supposed to go to Oppenheimer. We'll see if that happens. So, Catherine Thorm, Thorm is probably going to be fucking hard. Has a bunch of shit that they don't, they shouldn't have. You 
actually don't have it like any gear. Yeah. Shadow Arts go on. Just dickhead, how much do you have? some gear, yep. Sell all my shit, lady. Just tell me what you need. I need you to fucking accept all my shit. Okay. Lady like away. I don't know if I'm gonna be able just Fucking hard fight. No time to rest. But yeah, I just got a long ass, so I should be good. You dare show yourself here after you have betrayed me. You have betrayed General Thorm. Fuck General Thorm. And for what? And fuck you. Harpers. Moonrise will be there too. And in death, you will all serve. Like a kitten roaring at boys. Yep. You're about to get fucked in the ass, bitch. Ten minutes until I'm supposed to, until I'm supposed to leave. Seventy, seventy. Wow. It's a healthy amount of fucking life. That certainly stopped me. Okay, let's do. Should go throw some? No. some poison. Oh uh, yeah, okay. This might be pretty difficult. Well, a lot of misses so far. Three health. Not looking to be the most difficult thing. And I can't jump over. It all sim. I want you to fucking come out of hiding, motherfucker.
That big fat titted bitch. Does she have any weaknesses? Ooh. Okay, well. Should have cast a bless already. How many targets can I have? Six. See how this plays out. That ogre's gonna be dead fucking quick. I think that vine surface is going to help out a lot, but there is a lot of range back there. I just want to clump them all together right there and fucking... Damn it. Right there. That was a nice little free hit. There's the vines. You're gonna eat the fucking ice storm next, bitch.